So a lot of people want to know how to do a cat eye, and this is how to do an even elevated version of that, which is the extreme cat eye. I've already started with my model by doing a basic cat eye. What I did was just start at the lash line, apply it as thin as possible, and then build it thinnest at the middle of the eye and thicker to the outer part, and just do a nice little um, wing outwards. So we're just gonna continue building on top of this to make it a little more extreme. So I'm gonna take my liner. I'm just gonna keep building. I'm gonna build from this outer corner first since it's thickest at this part of the eye. Um, so we're just gonna keep making strokes downwards. And you wanna make sure that it blends in. You don't want it to be obvious that you've had a thinner line there or that you're building it. I really like this liner. It's very easy to use. This is a felt tip liner. I'm gonna draw the line out a little bit further as well. And for the extreme cat eye, I'm gonna kind of bring it down a little bit further than we had before and actually connect it underneath the eye. We wanna get this tip first. Now that we have a pretty good thick line, I'm gonna have her open her eyes and we're gonna take this liner down. It's gonna be a little bit difficult at first, but you wanna kind of just continue connecting it. If it's hard for you to do this with the liquid liner, you can even go through and I'll show you how to do it with either a regular liner or we can use cream. I think I'll show you with cream. It's a little bit easier to get in those um, tiny creases underneath the eye, but I do like this for the regular cat eye. So this is what it looks like. I'm just taking a little bit with a very thin little brush and I'm gonna kind of fill in. It's a little bit easier with this to get in these tight areas over here. Just making sure it's all flawless and you're as close to the lashes as possible. Cream liner is actually very easy to use. I think it's a little bit easier than liquid liner sometimes actually. You can get a little more precise with it dries very quickly, but I love both. And don't worry if the line's not perfect right now, we're gonna clean it up afterwards. We're gonna connect it over and bring it in. You don't necessarily have to go all the way into the inner corner, but I'm gonna kinda go a little more than halfway and you just kinda fade it thinner as you're going. So it's always thickest on the outer part going thinner. And if you notice, I'm kind of pulling the eye backwards with my finger over here just to kind of tighten it up. I'm just gonna go back and kind of reshape with the cream liner. So if you notice when her eye was open, it actually kind of threw off the line a little. So I'm gonna make it a little bit straighter here and then bend it downwards like this just so that when it opens, it's not quite as obvious. And you can do it less extreme than this. I'm showing the most extreme, like extreme Amy Winehouse, just so you can kind of see the max of where we can take this. But you can always do the same technique of bringing the liner down underneath without going quite as far out. You can definitely do that. So now I'm gonna go and clean up a little bit underneath the eye just to solidify that line. So now we're taking the concealer brush, a little bit of concealer, just kind of placing that right there, cleaning up that line. You can take it in this way a little bit too, just to clean all that up. All right, and that is how you do an extreme cat eye.